We're celebrating Western New York with a local man who is once again using his talented skills to create a work of art for members of the Bills. Now this time it was for defensive tackle Harrison Phillips. Two on your sides, Danielle Church shows us what it looked like and why Harrison says it meant so much to get something like that from a fan. Paul Cummings seems to be making more and more trips out to Bills Stadium during the postseason. That's because he has some special gifts to drop off. I looked at my wife and said, you know, it'd really be cool if we could, uh, if we could get one of Harrison too. And lo and behold, he messaged us a couple weeks later. Cummings made a special flag for head coach Sean McDermott in January, but needed some help getting it to him. He messaged Bill's defensive tackle Harrison Phillips, but didn't get a response until a few weeks after Cummings used Bill's Mafia's help to get the flag to McDermott. And I was like, man, this is really cool. I'm really bummed I wasn't able to help you. I'm glad it got to where it needed to be. And then he just threw out there like, hey, you want me to, to make one for you? And I was, uh, yeah, no brainer. This thing, is, this thing is sweet. Inspired by the American dream, the flag shows Phillips from high school to now. Since I was a, a really you know, a young kid, the American dream is something that I've wanted. I want the whole idea of you know, living a life, doing what you want to do every day. And so when we put Harrison on the flag, you know, even that makes sense. To do them for Harrison, to do them for coach, uh, yeah, it's, it's the coolest thing in the world. Cummings wanted Phillips to have a flag because he does so much charity work for Western New York. Phillips was even named Buffalo's Walter Payton Man of the Year this past season. Though he says he doesn't do nice things to get recognition, Phillips does feel pretty special to have gotten this flag. I've had too many of my teammates reply into my stories and asking about it that he, he's going to have more for the players. So I'm not the only player that's going to have one, but I am first. It does mean a lot that, you know, he didn't chase after the, the Pro Bowl guy or didn't chase after the starting. But this guy, he, he chose a player that he thought represented, uh, you know, the Western New York community. Cummings will drop off another flag for someone in the Bills franchise this Sunday. I'm not able to say who because it's supposed to be a surprise, but we will bring you more details when it happens this weekend. In Orchard Park, Danielle Church, Channel 2 News. Thank you, Danielle. He is a fan favorite, too. He does a lot no of Western question. New York, so good for him. What a unique tribute. That's yeah. really uh, awesome, isn't it? Yeah, those are great, great keepsakes. No question.